Today I'm teaching you how to make an organic four foot grab and go garland. For each cluster, you need two 17 inch balloons and four 11 inch balloons. I will be using my brand new Air Force Four to inflate this garland. Start by inflating two of your 11 inch balloons fully and then pressing the air out of them. Crisscross the necks and then tie them as close to the base as possible so you can get those long stretchy necks that we're gonna use for later. Now taking your two 17 inch balloons, you're going to fully inflate those and then press the air out of them until they're about 14 inches in diameter. I also like to wrap my necks twice before I tie them into a knot. The cluster I'm making now is in real time so I can show you guys just how fast the Air Force 4 inflates your balloons. It takes about 2 seconds for an 11 inch balloon and 3.5 and seconds for a 17 inch balloon. Take your two 11 inch duplets, you're gonna wrap those twice around one another and then add in your 17 inch duplet. It's easier to wrap these when I'm not on camera, but I like to make sure I have a 17 inch on the top and the bottom with all four 11 inches in the center. This is how the cluster should look when you're finished. Now I'm inflating the rest of the balloons for this garland, not in real time, but I do have a timer just to show you guys how fast you can inflate and twist all of these balloons with this Air Force 4. I have used my pink Amazon pump for the last two years, and if you're starting out, that is a perfect pump for you to get started. This year, my goal is to cut down on the time it takes me to do any of my installs, and so far, this pump has cut down my time in half. It takes me under four minutes to inflate, tie together, and install a four-foot garland. Now that we have all of our clusters, we're going to start tying them neck to neck. Find the longest neck in your first cluster, find the longest neck in your second cluster, and then pull those tightly together and tie them into a knot. If this is your first time tying them neck to neck, it will probably feel really difficult to you, but that's okay. Just keep practicing. It does get easier. Tying neck to neck creates a very tight fit and a solid structure to build on. Now that we have all of our necks tied to one another to create a four foot garland, we're going to install it on the wall with my command hook and my 260. Just wrap your 260 around a back balloon. Fluff the garland on the wall to fit the space that it's in. And there you have it, a four foot garland constructed in under four minutes. 